MB. And that's MB. We are the Loot Troop. Today we have Loot Crate. Uh, various different size Loot Crates. Yeah, this is probably the biggest I've received. It's and the deepest you've ever went. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, this is my third Loot Crate now. Deep Loot Crate. A deep Loot Crate. The theme for this month was Cyber. And we'll open it shortly after I tell you a little bit about Loot Crate. Loot Crate is a subscription service from the US, delivering to various countries, including the UK. And what they do is they set up a theme every month and you'll get various items inside the crate based upon that theme. So the very first one I received was Fantasy and that was based around Game of Thrones, Dungeons and Dragons. Last month's was <coughs> Night and the Princess Bride. Thank you. My name is Inika Montana. <coughs> you killed my father. Prepare to die. <laughs> and last month the theme was Unite and in that you got various superhero items so there was an Avengers Ice Cube tray an Avengers car decal some Age of Ultron shoelaces and comics all of the various things like that this month's theme is Cyber working around robots and the fact that Terminator Genesis is about to be released in cinemas so with that we shall open it up. Blade. Let's get in. And have a what happened? What have we got inside? First of all. Class. Can I just say? Class. Bit of a Terminator skeleton there. I'm not interested in I mean I am interested <coughs> in that, but you've got like a old school Optimus Prime type either. Yeah. I mean, it, it's going to be a t-shirt, but it could be a tea towel. But it's an Optimus Prime tea towel. What I will add is this one here was from last month's Loot Crate, and it's a manga mashup of the Green Ranger from Power Rangers, and it's awesome. But it's not as good as that. Right, let's have a look. First of all, Loot Crate exclusive is a Terminator Genesis Endo skull. Class. I'm sorry, but I'm opening this now. It's got to come out. I don't want to see what it's like. It's very light, so it's not metal or die cast. It's a squeezy plastic skull. Yeah, but it's not The detail in it is absolutely fantastic. It's well sculpted. Very well sculpted. Look at that. Big red eyes. Need that on top so of like a walking evil. stick. I think it's going to, if I look at the loot crate, ah, yeah, you need on the way to set up, these boxes. that's going to go something like that. You can see that with the head sat on top. Look at that. Yeah, that's how it'll go. That's great. But we'll go more into that at the end. The thing is with that, what that tells me is that they're not just getting garbage that won't sell. There's actually been some thought gone into that. Yeah. There's always some items in there which will appeal to some people and some which don't. For me, I really like the t-shirts that I've received in the loot crates and for me, I mean the subscription is £20 a month and for a t-shirt you pay at least £10-£15 and the quality in these t-shirts is really good and now you're getting added bonuses. Play this bad boy. Yeah, the Gildan t-shirt, and Yeah, Gildan, yeah. Um, Gildan is... Oh, the three I've got so far have been. Whether they'll continue with that, I'm, I'm sure they'll probably will. But, yeah. That is a Terminator That school. just sat anywhere. Is it? Is. Next. We've got to do it. Yes. There is. It's sort of like a Tron thing. The t-shirt. Yeah, an Optimus Prime this. Tron mashup. Again, 
Gildan t shirt, I yeah, believe. Let me have a quick look. No, no, this one isn't. This is by Rock Me. So it's not Gildan, this one's Rock Me. But, quality. Again, you can feel it's a nice quality t shirt, and the print on it is brilliant. Optimus Prime, Generation 1 season of Transformers. So, could I go and buy this t shirt? Without the loot crate, or is this? I don't actually know. Possibly. I suppose maybe if you go on eBay, some people who have loot crates might sell certain various items from them, especially if they don't like them. But, but that is literally. I'll a loot be keeping that exclusive. And I'll be wearing way, that. Shot over there. Next, there's a patch. Future Replicants patch. I'm not entirely sure what that's from. And with all other loot crates, you always get a badge in them which says the theme and the date of the loot crate. And for this one, it's June 2015 and Cyber. Next, we've got. It's quite hefty that. Mm. That's metal. That. That's yeah. a key ring and yeah. a replica of the brain chip. Yeah, a replica of the brain chip that's inside the Terminator skull in the Terminator movies. Yeah, that's good. Kind of like a yeah Terminator galaxy pack. Next, every month you get your little loot crate magazine, and it'll explain the various themes in there. Yeah, so we'll close that up. Next, in the crate, we've got a hefty size mouse mat. Next, you've got some stickers from the Nerd HQ. You see them themed to Spider Man, Iron Man. A couple of little things on there. That's San Diego, July the 9th through to the 12th, 2015. Viva Le Nerd Illusion. Yeah, that's good. Next, for Battlestar Galactica fans, BSG. For range facility use Hold only. On you. Is it? Uh, it'll be the new one, I would assume. We'll find out. Based on whatever this is, yeah, yeah. it's the new one. On that, is a poster but is also a target. It's a target poster. Glossy yeah. A3 size, would yeah. you say? Probably, yeah. You get two of them inside there. Hang up on your wall, throw a dart at them. Thing. You hit the set if you uh, don't like the sign ons. Look good in a frame then. Then take your wrath out on them. Yeah, they would. You could frame them, put them up. Right, next we'll go on to the box. Every Loot Crate box tells you what to do with it. Document, share and enjoy. These are for everybody. We're doing these videos to show you what you get in them and give our different little opinions on, on things we get on them. Some little trinkets in there you like, some you don't. But with all the Loot Crate boxes, they also go inside out because they have a little theme based on them. So, with this one, it is Terminators. And what we'll do is we'll cut off and we'll come back once this is built up and we'll give our final thoughts on the crate. Yep. And we're back. We've set up the loot crate after some hardship. <laughs> we couldn't be bothered looking for any scissors, so we just hacked it with a knife. As you'll see, but luckily, I'm still in knife work. We're going to be we're not. We're not. <laughs> We've got everything. We only done it because we promised it to use. Yeah. Otherwise, we wouldn't have even. The things it. we do for the subscribers that we don't yet have is absolutely the amazing. The last two that we done was literally a box flip inside out. Yeah, this one. There was a bit of craftsmanship required. And you'll see, we're not very good at DIY. 
probably because we're nerds. We've got everything laid out on the on the desk for you now, and we're just going to go around and show everything one last time and give our thoughts on it. First off, you've got your little magazine there. You get one of these every month, and you can see that's number twenty-three. Your LC magazine. Yeah. Blue Crate official. You got your nerd HQ stickers. I like these. Yeah, they're really good. I'll detail some of them on my laptop, I think. There, yeah, cool. Next. Ah! You've got your Terminator headset up there. It says on the top there visit lootcrate.com. Cybercrate for assembly instructions, and by God, we needed it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and even with them, it took us a while to work it out. But that's all set up there, and you know, look cool. It's a nice little way to, dis to display it there with a few terminators in the background. Battlestar Galactica range sheet there for all your aiming goodness. That's a Get separate patch on. that we had a look at. What's on? Yeah. I'm I don't sure what that's off, is it? I vaguely remember reading it's a future replicants patch. I'm not sure what that's from. Could be Blade Runner with replicants, maybe. I you just can know. tell us that. Yeah, I'm sure someone will know. Drop something in the comments and tell us. Yeah, what please do. That is. Save me some work looking it up. Tell me what it is, please. You got your little badge there. June 2015 cyber pencil case keychain. That's that's good. That that's you know. It's a nice little thing to add. It's a little trinket, a little keepsake. Put it on your keys. Do whatever you want with it. Official member there, looter. T-shirt. I think this is where you get close to getting your your money back in a wanna. Is through the t-shirt. Oh yeah, definitely. Each loot crate's supposed to have, or oh, it's up to about 50, at least fifty dollars worth of loot in there. Some people have totted it up before, and you know, I said they've got. 60 70 dollars worth in one crate which when you're paying 19.99 for you know it's not a bad return but if you're interested in all the stuff you know like i am then it's not too bad i mean borderlands is a good game that's a nice mouse mat something to use really sharp when your other one runs design. out i don't have I, I briefly added all borderlands I, it wasn't one that got me hooked but it's it's really crisp, really clear, and it's a decent size, isn't it? It's yeah, it's a big size mouse mat. Size. It's, it's actually bigger than my Razer mouse mat that I have at home. Uh, yeah, it's a big size on that. But the t-shirts, I mean, as I've said earlier, you're going to pay at least ten, fifteen pounds for it. If you're a nerd, and most people that get these are, then you're going to be happy with that t-shirt. Really happy, especially with Generation One Optimus Prime. That's fantastic. And a little mashup with the Tron as well, it just you know, it just adds to it. But that's the bad boy. That little Terminator head. Not die cast metal, but that doesn't make a difference. The details there. It's a nice little trinket you can just display it on your desk, on a shelf at home. Have it hanging off the shelf maybe. You know, it's good. Overall, I'm I'm quite happy with this. The loot crates for for me seem to get over the last three months, I've got better with each one. Yeah, so based on these loot crates, I would definitely up to now score this first position on what I like. Yeah. I'm not a huge fan of the Borderland stuff, but just the, the T1000 or whatever it is, head, the t shirt, the stickers, sorted. Add yeah. to that the keychain, which is a great touch. Yeah. You know, nice little add on. Not only that, it's geeky. You see that on keys and you don't know what that is. You're not a geek. No, your nerd card's removed. Yeah, get out. <laughs> Whenever you get asked what that is, don't talk to her. Yeah. Even if it's your, your own blood. <laughs> <laughs> Write up something and get rid. Yeah. Trade something in. Yeah, I mean, there's always going to be certain items or even themes I think in the loot crate that don't agree with everybody but you know you're still getting quality gear for what you pay for 
it's nineteen ninety nine a month. Loot Crate pick the themes based on feedback. It tends to be lately, you know, it's tied in with big releases, major movies, certain things like that. So obviously, you know, your big thing for you is Terminator. That's what you've got your biggest exclusives on. Uh, April's theme mainly was Game of Thrones. You got a USB stick. Um, a that was good. Fridge magnet set based around all the houses. See, it threw me now that because yeah, I'm without the crown, you know. So is it? So I'll have a first place then. The crown definitely is. Mm -hmm. The crown beats all. If you could wear, if you could wear that. You're gonna have to get it put on like a big chain for the Christmas special. <laughs> if we if we have fifty viewers, fifty subscribers by Christmas, we'll wear the Terminator wrap chain. Yeah. I'll have that on a chain. Yeah. And I'll wrap some sick beads. Yeah. So for that, you know, I'm quite happy with that. It's the best loot crate I've got so far. Optimus Prime T shirt it stands out for me. Best one you've it. got. Definitely. Yeah, definitely the best T shirt I've got. So, yeah, you know, please subscribe to the channel, comment below, 